Well, I have to tell you, it's really uh, amazing to see all these shoes kind of come back to life um, as retros over the years. I remember designing shoes. I remember, re remember working with Michael Jordan uh, and actually um, executing all kinds of drawings, all kinds of artistic sort of expressions of early design work. And so the files, we have all of these files of, of you know, the, of the design project and for, for pretty much just documented through these drawings. Well, leave it to uh, Mark Smith to um, go through all of those files and find uh, really colorful and interesting sketches, early design sketches, and come up with the idea of using a high-tech printer and then projecting onto the shoe and printing the, those drawings that were actually the precursors to the shoes themselves. So I think that's just a brilliant idea and, bring, and puts, a, puts a different spin on how you look at a shoe design. The reason Mark did this you know, and came, came up with this wonderful idea um, uh, and a very unique one at that uh, was to uh, really put together a series of shoes so that um, we could raise money for the Dornbecker Children's Hospital. And that's a really uh, important uh, charity that we um, all participate in here in the Portland area. And it's one of the great children's hospitals in the world for, um, for helping kids and their families get through really difficult times. I am I'm proud to be a part of it just because I you know, designed this stuff originally. And then I'm proud to be a part of it yet again um, to explain to you um, kind of what it's all about. Uh, I also hope that uh, some of you really uh, step up and um, uh, bid, um, uh, bid strongly for um, you know, obtaining one of these shoes because the money really does go for an amazing cause.